Exodus 7:27 Ve'im ein ata l'shalach Hine Anochi no gave et kol gavulacha batsafar ta'im Now in this context Moses has been sent to Pharaoh to say thus says the Lord release my people and we continue with his message but if you refuse to release the people behold i am going to uh strike or smite you in all the borders of you in all your borders that is in all your land with frogs ma'in this is just a little tricky uh to to get at this form now this is a pl participle uh, pl participle masculine singular and, and and we have the um subject spelled out you uh, well the reason it's tricky is normally uh here at the beginning we'd have a mem with a shva attached to the front and that's not what we have uh we just have the the rest of the participle so we get a little bit of help here from gazanius at um 52 s who makes the point that every once in a while you have this participle without the mem attached and it's especially the case with an em in the front so if you refuse that's how gazania says the mem here refuses it plus it's after the em now here we have another participle all three root letters showing to strike uh this is a call participle and again the subject is spelled out i the lord am going to smite uh, so it's masculine singular um and here we're going to um return one more time to gazanius to get just a little bit of help uh with the sense here why isn't this in the present sense of the term so gazanius at 116 um p helps us to see that when we have a participle especially when it's with the term behold that is hine just as we have here so behold then it's almost a contingency i am about to so there's something going to happen in the imminent future i am about to smite all of egypt so look at the um syntactical relationship here so if you refuse and we have another um infinitive construct the auxiliary to release them then behold I am about to smite all of Egypt with frogs